It's a heated, controversial vote which has grabbed the attention of thousands of Catholic school students. I'm Adrian Gobriel. Recently, trustees here at the Halton Region Catholic District School Board voted to stop raising funds for charities that they believe are violate the sanctity of life. It's a stance, a motion, a vote which is receiving plenty of pushback from students. I really call upon our uh, school trustees to hear the students within the boards. We are here to make a difference. Do not let our opinions just be pushed to the side. This is a very important issue to us. More than 8,000 students have signed a petition, and the Student Senate also voted 45 to 0 to have the board's motion repealed. The motion, which trustees voted 5 to 3 in favor of, in part reads that because it is a Catholic institution, we will not provide or facilitate donations to any charities or nonprofits that publicly support either directly or indirectly abortion, contraception, sterilization, euthanasia, or embryonic stem cell research. That could mean Mean that institutions like Sick Children's Hospital, which do some sort of stem cell research, could be banned from receiving funds from the Halton Catholic District School Board. Society is continuously changing as well as our progression and our advancements and I think that it's important to at least take into consideration the amount of good that we have the potential of doing. As our values are changing, we must keep in mind that faith isn't the only thing that should restrict our values, but there are so many other um, important terms to keep in mind, such as members of our community, our schools, our families, people who are involved in such great causes that can benefit everyone else. Even with the thoughtful student pushback, it appears the board is still plowing ahead. In an email, the board tells City News they still plan to review their fundraising policy. And a statement from the board chair reads, the board of trustees adopted a motion to ensure that funds raised through our schools are donated to charities and organizations that support activities that are keeping with the mission of our Catholic school system. We will continue to encourage our schools to participate in fundraising efforts in accordance with our policy. Now, it's important to note that there were three student trustees also at that meeting where the vote took place. They voted against it, though their votes don't really count because they are non-binding votes. Now, the students I spoke with today say they're going to be bringing their petition, which keeps growing each and every day, to the board meeting on March 20th. Now, we reached out to the board chair as well as the trustee who tabled the motion for some response in an on-camera interview in reaction to the student's stance. They declined a request for an interview.